Hello and good day. Welcome to our video channel, God's Promises. And today's video will be Book of Exodus 32. Let's get started now. Exodus 32 tells the story of the Israelites' idolatry and God's response to it. Here is a verse-by-verse -verse analysis. Verse 1 to 4, the Israelites become restless and ask Aaron to make them gods to go before them, as they are unsure of what happened to Moses. Aaron instructs them to bring their gold earrings and he makes a golden calf for them to worship. Verse 5 to 6, Aaron builds an altar before the calf and declares a feast day for the people to worship the idol. Verse 7 to 10, God becomes angry with the Israelites and tells Moses to go down from the mountain, as the people have corrupted themselves with their idolatry. God threatens to destroy them and make a new nation from Moses. Verse 11 to 14, Moses intercedes on behalf of the people, reminding God of his promises to Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. Moses pleads with God to spare the people and not bring reproach on his name among the nations. Verse 15 to 20, Moses goes down from the mountain and sees the idolatrous behavior of the people. He throws down the tablets of the law and destroys the golden calf, grinding it into powder and making the people drink it. Verse 21 to 24, Moses confronts Aaron about the idolatry and Aaron tries to make excuses for his actions. Verse 25 to 29, Moses calls for those who are loyal to the Lord to come to his side, and the Levites join him. Moses commands the Levites to go throughout the camp and kill those who have participated in the idolatry, and they slay about 3,000 men that day. Verse 30 to 35, Moses returns to the Lord and pleads for his forgiveness on behalf of the people. He offers himself as a sacrifice for their sin, but God tells him that each person will be held accountable for their own sin. God strikes the people with a plague as a punishment for their idolatry. The story of Exodus 32 teaches several important lessons. First, it warns against the dangers of idolatry and the consequences of turning away from God. Second, it shows the power of intercession and the importance of standing up for what is right, even when others may be following the wrong path. Finally, it emphasizes the importance of personal accountability and the need for each individual to take responsibility for their own actions. Thank you for visiting us today. Please share with us your favorite Bible verse below in the comments section. Don't forget to like and subscribe. It really does help our channel grow. Looking forward to see you back here for our next video. Always take good care.